Hey guys, I'm going to show you what you need to do if you are trying to share one of your resources with somebody else, but it's saying that they need to request access. This is the resource I'm going to use today. It's my Rainbow Middle High School Daily Agenda. It's something that I have for sale on Teachers Be Teachers. I'll link it below if you're interested in purchasing. But for today, this is going to be really, really simple. You need to go up to your share button. Right now, it is private to only me. If I were to click on this and type in someone's name, they would not be able to access it because I have this restricted. You want to make it so that anyone with the link that you send to them is able to open it there. And then this button right here shows up. Do you want them to just be able to view it? Maybe if it's your students, you only want them to view it or if it's somebody that you want to give you some feedback, you can make them a commenter so they can just tell you things that you need to improve upon. Or if it's someone that you want to be an actual collaborator or an editor for, for you, editor, editor for you, you can click on this and they can actually change your resource itself. Be careful with that one because if that is clicked and then you send it out to a bunch of people, some people are not so tech savvy and they might accidentally delete a slide or or the whole presentation and not be sure how to get it back. So be careful with allowing other people to be editors of your original resources. If you're not sure how to make people make a copy of your resources when you share it with them, go see my other video. I will also link that in the bottom. It is such a quick thing to do, but it will save you so much time in having to fix original copies that people accidentally change. All right, guys, I hope that was helpful. Let me know in the comments what more you'd like to learn.